Uh, hello, Mr. Atrophy here. Um, quick little video. I just did a lot, and uh, I'm, I'm a little beat. I just spent about an hour working on the tank. So you see some changes right away. Um, I turned the rock on the side, moved the Loidensis in back. I took out the parva, spread the hair grass out. Doing that, I disturbed the Mexican oak because uh, some of them were starting to rot and, and die. So I took out the dead ones replanted the good ones, moved them further in the corner. Um, and looking at this now, what I envision in the future, the dwarf hair grass is going to spread all through here and all through there where I'm going to keep it short, um, you know, maybe about that tall. But going back there, I'm going to let it grow taller. Um, growing back in there, I'm going to let it grow taller. Um, but in the front, it's going to be short. The Loidensis should grow up straight through here, coming forward a little bit. That's going to move out more and get bigger over time, you know, about that big. Um, that should split and grow up. Um, that'll get really huge if I let it, so I'm going to, you know, keep trimming it about that tall. Um, the catalyst for this, I had two deaths recently. One of the shrimps croaked. Um, he had a traumatic molt, a bad molt, where he didn't, uh, wasn't able to take all of his shell off. And uh, couldn't eat after that. And there was really nothing I could do. And uh, he died. And he died where I could grab him, right over here. But the auto that died was under this thing. So I had to move this and get him out. Because he started to stink. It started to do a, um, an ammonia spike. And uh, so doing this now, I accomplished a couple things. I got uh, the, the dead fish out, which will help the ammonia. But also, I stirred up, man, probably about 80% of the top gravel on here. And that kicked up a bunch of stuff into the water column. Um, so I did a water change for two reasons, to help get the ammonia down and to take a lot of that detrius out of the water column so it didn't settle. I've got the filter on high, you can see it gathering stuff up right there and it's been, it's, it is majorly clearing up. Um, so that accomplished uh, a lot of cleaning up. Um, I got a lot of stuff out, a lot of the detrius out, which I'm having a problem with this stuff. I'm having a problem with um, a couple of different critters as you saw so hopefully getting all of this stuff out will help. Um, in a few hours I'm gonna have to change the filter because I know that's getting plugged. I can see it slowing down as we talk. So have a nice day and uh, in a day or two I will be uh, shooting another one and you will see the Loidensis perk back up and straighten up. Um, this stuff will be looking good. Hopefully the Mexican oak will be doing good. Um, I didn't touch that, so that should be doing good. I left that guy alone because I love, I'm love. i loving this uh, spiralis. That's an awesome damn plant.